Morning guys. Um, thought I'd do an update here. Uh, I posted a video yesterday in reference to how to uh, load your music onto the Prime 4. Um, made a mistake in that video, so I took the video down. And what I'm going to do is I'll just explain what the mistake was and what I find. I'm still having sort of an issue getting this to work correctly, but um, I did get a note from Denon with the exact procedure and I'm going to put that link uh, in the description of this video so you can all click on that and read it for yourselves. Um, the link is how to install, prepare, and load music into Prime 4's internal SATA drive. Now they did say to me that the way I did it will work but it's not analyzing the files so that it would have to go through its own it would analyze them as I played them. Uh, and when I redid it again this morning, it it uh, it did analyze all the files, so I could see that. The other issue that I am having is when that happens, is the deck supposed to not read the drive and you have to restart the Prime 4? Uh, because that's happening every time I try to load music in successfully or unsuccessfully. Every time I switch over to the blue cord to the computer, when I'm done with removing the drive from the Prime 4, I have to shut the machine down and reboot. So I don't know if that's right or that's wrong. So, um, But it works after I restart. So, um, what, what happened was, uh, I'm gonna, I'll post this in the, um, in, the, in the description below. And what I did is I left out Prime, uh, I left out Step 6. Um, everything that I described in the video was correct all the way up until I dragged and dropped the music. At that point, I should have opened up Engine Prime and then dragged the music uh, from the computer to Engine Prime. <clears throat> Another question I have is, does the music have to be on the laptop or in the PC, or can it be in an external drive connected to the PC? That's another question. Um, so I don't know. Because what I did was the flash drive I took that music off of last night, I dragged that music into the desktop of the PC and it worked like flawless. But coming off of the flash drive and dragging it into the, uh, the file, it didn't work that way. So I don't know if that's something I'm doing wrong or should it do it, yes or no. That's what I'm thinking. But uh, there's some other information on here um, that is good information. Um, they do tell you what size drive can you install. It used to, in the initial release, it was supposed to be a one terabyte SSD SATA drive or HHD or HDD. Um, but now there is no drive capacity size limitation, so um, as long as it is formatted in FAT32 or XFAT. Um, and you have to have a master boot record style partition structure. So I let the computer do that. So, um, But what, it, uh, what I'll do is I'll post this in there and... Uh, Hopefully this helps out. Sorry for the screw up on that video, but uh, I figured I'd pull that down and, and put the right thing up there because I don't want to say something wrong that isn't writing. So, <laughs> But uh, it does work the other way, but it works better this way. But those little quirks that I mentioned, I'd really like to find out a little bit more about that. So I may drop a note to Denon and, and ask that question and I'll let you know when I find out. So that's my video for today. Um, check out the link below, and that'll uh, get you on track. You guys, have a great rest of your day, and we'll talk to you soon.